Hi everyone, it's Becca. Welcome back to another video. I've had this sitting around for a couple of days now and I've been so lazy, probably maybe even a week, but I want to do a review on the Sephora Iconic Play box or bag. Um, this is not a subscription service. It is or was just one time. They might be doing it again. Um, I'm via B Rouge, so I got like early access to it. So yeah, it's not a monthly box like their normal play boxes. Um, and it does cost $20 and comes with six deluxe uh, or six samples, deluxe size samples I believe, of high end of luxury brand makeup. So their normal box doesn't have luxury brands, but this does. So for twice as much, again not a subscription like the other one is, but for twice as much one time purchase, you get six uh, luxury brand samples. And I will be comparing it to my regular play box just to see what they are. Again, one's a subscription, one's not, but just to see what you get for the price. So, um, let me go in with my normal one, and I will just be talking about the products from last month. Um, I think I've used a couple, so I can update you guys on that. Okay, so last month I got the Trestique Highlight Imperfect Multipurpose Stick in Maldives Luminescence, I believe. I am actually wearing it as a base today under my Tarte, like that rainbow highlighter. Um, so yeah, and I passed it along to my cousin, and she is absolutely loving that. She really, really likes it. Um, so I think it could be used as on its own or as a base, but yeah, I happen to be wearing it today. I've really been enjoying that. Um, the Nude Stick Magnetic Matte Lip Color, have not worn that yet. The Belief Water Essence, have not used that yet. The Tatcha Cleansing Oil, haven't used that yet. Um, the Omega, the Rahua Omega 9 hair mask. I have used that but I really have not seen anything too special about it. Really doesn't do much more than my normal conditioner. I mean I love my normal conditioner. But yeah it really did not moisturize that much. I didn't think. I've used it a couple times now. Um, and I didn't like the scent of that. So I'm not a fan of that one. And then the Toka Stella I have not worn that either. So only a couple products I could update you on. So now for the current play box. It says your summer starters. I like this package, it's really cool, they even did the play to go along with the picture, so I actually really like that, I think that's pretty cool, and they have all different women here, so that's cool. Ooh, and the bag is absolutely gorgeous as well with these blue tassels, really liking that, and it says, in a summer state of mind, yes, it has been super hot here, don't have AC in my car, and I just drove to an interview, so yes, it's, it's definitely summer, I can tell you that. Anyway, the first thing out of here, woo, this looks like a good size sample. This is the Verb Sea Spray, okay, windswept waves plus light dry texture. I mean, I unfortunately don't have too many waves to my hair anymore, um, but maybe I should use one of these. So it says jump in the cool, that's funny. Oh no, that's not the one, huh? <laughs> see and be seen. Um, so it contains hydrating seaweed, okay, that's something I worry about with sea sprays, sea salt sprays and kelp extract to add texture and volume for loose waves. Ooh, okay. Hey, I mean, I'll try it, right? It says for effortless mermaid waves. I'll give it a shot. Um, let me smell that. It has a nice spray. Ooh, and it smells very good. Ooh, I really like that, really like oceany, perfect for summer. Yeah, I really enjoy that, okay. The next thing in here is the Porefessional. I already have this, um, but I have been noticing my pores a little more, so that's interesting. So I guess I could use this, but um, my mom loves this. It just looks like a small sample here, um, but um, I, you know, I already do know I like this, so that's the thing about these subscriptions is sometimes I do get things I already have, um, but I might keep that or pass along to my mom, and that was, it's, it's all poor you, that's funny. Okay, the next thing in here is this Chlorine, um, looks like dry shampoo with oat milk. It's a French brand, um, and it says up in the hair, that's funny. Cult favorite dry shampoo made with oat milk, absorbs excess oil, and adds volume for soft, refreshed hair. I've been noticing I've been needing dry shampoo more late, more dry shampoo lately. Ooh, this cap was on tight, okay. That's a really strong, uh, spray if you can see that. And it smells okay, it smells decent. So there is that. Um, I'm gonna wait for the perfume for the end. Ooh, this is Kat Von D. Everlasting Liquid Lipstick and Love Sick. I don't believe I have this one. Is this a new one? 
Um, because I have the Lovecraft lipstick, the regular lipstick, I believe. I think, and I like that. Um, ooh, I love the Kat Von D formula, so this is super exciting. Uh, and it says a whole lot of lip. <laughs> yeah, this color looks really gorgeous too. So that I'm super ex excited about that. Wow, that's awesome. And then the last thing again. Uh, ooh, it's a Kula makeup setting spray. Oh, I thought it was gonna be a moisturizer. That's exciting. It says jump in the cool. Yes, that's funny. Weightless do-it-all setting mist keeps makeup looking fresh, reduces the appearance of pores, and provides SPF 30 sun protection. That's really cool. I mean, I don't know how much protection you get from just one little mist, um, but that is really cool. If, like, if you forgot to put sunscreen on or if you don't like wearing sunscreen in your makeup, um, but then you decide to go out or something, you can spray it on. Um, that's really cool. I'll definitely be playing around with that. And then the, the perfume is Bulgaria Omnia Crystalline cool packaging there and it says a gem of a fragrance a fresh fragrance made with lotus flower nashi and balsa wood that evokes the radiance of a crystal uh -huh. and it says uh, fragrance it's a fresh fragrance top notes bamboo middle notes lotus flower base notes balsa wood so let's spray this on okay let it dry down that's pretty yeah I like that um I wouldn't say it's super unique, but, oh, that's nice. I, I do like it. So, I'm really enjoying this month. I mean, despite that I already have the Porefessional, but I think this setting spray is really cool with SPF in it. Love me some Kat Von D liquid lipsticks, and I don't think I have that one. Dry shampoo can never, you know, have enough of those. And uh, the salt spray I'm intrigued by. So, yeah, in super cute bag. Um... I'm really excited about that. So that's what you could get for $10, you could get something like that um, every month. But then this is just the iconic box and it's in a black box. This is $20 a month, like I said, six luxury brand, um, six luxury brand samples. Um, so it came in a black box and actually came in a normal Sephora box itself, whereas this, the play just comes, the regular play just comes as is, like that's the box they send it to you in. Um, but this came in a box itself, so I got three samples with it. So let's open it up. Ooh, it looks very luxurious. This is what I see. So you have a whole, like, booklet fancy. Did pay ten more dollars for that. Um, and then this bag, I mean, it is metallic, but looks a little cheap in my opinion. But this booklet, uh, that's something, I guess. So let's open this up. I mean, I do appreciate it's not the white bag that they normally have, you know, they're trying to step it up for this luxury one. Okay, so this is a YSL, let me go to the handy dandy booklet booklet to find out what it is. Ooh, look at this paper, it's gold, it's the iconic edition, okay, um, a bold lip. With Yves Saint Laurent Rouge Volupte Shine Oil and Stick Lipstick in 49 Bright Strawberry Pink. Okay, so let's try that. Wow, that is bright pink. Oh yeah, and it is just very glossy and shiny, perfect for summer. Um, so that's cool. This next thing, everything's packaged well in the bag. This next thing is the Guerlain Paris Leur Radiance Concentrate with Pure Gold Makeup Base. Oh, is this the one um, that Cassie Thrift Thick always uses? Let's see. Yes, I think it is. It's like it has the gold, 24 karat gold flex. Um, ooh, I'm really excited about this. Let's ooh, let let's uh, get into this. I just want to see it. <gasps> ooh, yes. This looks so pretty. Ooh, I'm excited. I mean, it's just a small sample, but still, that's nice. Ooh, wow. Yeah, and these two things I've never had before. Never tried before, rather. Oh, I'm getting excited. This next thing, this feels heavy. This is the Dior Poison Girl Eau de Toilette. Oh, so maybe it's just a bigger sample. <laughs> How to be iconic in any occasion. That's funny. There's some other, like, extra things in the back here. Um, a finishing touch with Dior Poison Girl. Okay, so it's a um, spin-off of the cult classic Poison. Oh, and Christian Dior was known for his love of gardens and flowers. Okay. Interesting. 
So let's see. Again, nice outer packaging. So here that is. That's like a pretty a decent sized sample. But it's not a spray. I'm trying to get a scent of it. Um, yeah, it's a pretty strong perfume, I would say. Um, so not something I normally would go for, but we shall see. Okay, the next thing in here is L Lamar. Ooh, it's very expensive. The Moisturizing Soft Cream. There's that, sorry. Um, and it says... What does it say? It has little directions, and it's just a little pot there. Um, so maybe it's a night cream. But La Mer is very expensive. They aren't kidding around with these brands. Uh, oh So Soft Skin. It's a nutrient rich miracle broth. Um, yeah, so it's just, you got a nighttime routine, deep hydration. Okay. Okay, the fifth thing in here is this Burberry. Ooh, another very expensive brand. They really weren't kidding with these. And this is the Burberry Cat Lashes. So mascara. Feline fringe with Burberry Cat Lashes. Mascara. Voluminous eye-opening effect. Uh, hourglass shaped brush, which is like my better than sex. So, and it's supposed to give you feathery lashes. So I love the outer packaging of this. Very cool. Um, and then here's what the sample looks like. Obviously the samples don't look as nice as what the real packaging is, but I'm excited to try that. And then the last thing, so it's the same number of products as the Sport Play, um, is Tom Ford Black Orchid. So another perfume. I wish we had had one more makeup thing. Um, but let's see what this is. It says the last impression of Tom Ford Black Orchid. And this is just a small one. So maybe, yeah, I guess... I don't know, but it says, with rich fruit accords, features black truffle, black orchid, and black plum. Wow. All something with black in it. Um, so it comes in its little own package. And here it is. Oh, and it's a little bigger too, perhaps. But again, oh, this is a rollerball. Whoa, that is strong. Oh, not something I normally go for. Oh, that is very, very strong. But... Yeah, um, I'm probably least excited about the perfumes, just because those are pretty easy to try, but La Mer, that's pretty good, even if it is just a moisturizer. Really excited about this Guerlain primer, super excited about that. Burberry mascara, I'm excited to try that, I've never tried that before. And this lipstick looks pretty nice, so yeah, I mean, it's $20. Um, I will leave the prices of actually how much it was worth down below and compare it to the re regular Sport Play. Those normally um, cost-wise or value-wise rather are about $35 for the samples you get. So not terrible but not great either. Ipsy ends up being more usually which is also $10 a month. So this probably hopefully will be more than $20 worth. I, I'm sh I assume it will be. Um, but was it worth it for me? I'd say yeah. I mean. I'm not sure if I'd do it again. I mean, probably I will because I love these just these little sample things. Um, but I, I think I'm, I'd say I'm excited about like three things out of the six. So and that's not terrible. Um, I love trying things out. So yeah, I think, uh, you know, take take this video for what it is. You can make your own decision uh, if you want more the $10 a month, but every month kind of kit or kind of a bag or subscription box or if you just want to get something every once in a while I assume they'll have these again I don't know when um, or this one itself if it's going on sale um, but these are more one-time purchase but more luxury and costs more initially that $20 um, so yeah I think they're it's great that they're kind of branching out I kind of like that I remember them asking a while ago if we would like a luxury brand one. So anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this video and hope you guys are all doing well. And until next time, bye everyone. Hi everyone, it's Becca. It's night. I'm just back again. I just wanted to say thank you so much to everyone who subscribed to me. I have now over 100 subscribers and that's just really special to me. Oh, my cat's meowing outside my door. Hold on one second. Yeah, so sorry if the lighting's bad, but I just wanted to say this before I forgot. can't believe I forgot, but yeah, I have over 100 subscribers now and that's really special to me. I know that's not a lot to basically anyone out there. Um, but it is for me. It was my first kind of big milestone. You know, it's taken me over a year, but I don't care. I really like that. Have you 
you all who are loyal and um, have been great. So I really appreciate that. My next big thing I would like is just some more interaction going on in the comment section. That would be great just for me, but for you guys too to get to know each other. Um, but yeah, I'm super grateful and I will be obviously continuing my channel, my videos. I've been having a really great time. Uh, been slacking off for the past couple week, week or so, but um, yeah, I'm just really, really, really grateful. So I just wanted to say that. Um, so yeah, hopefully my channel will continue to grow and we can just all have a great time getting to know each other and playing around with makeup. So yeah, um, as always, just leave any requests for videos you have down below. But um, yeah, I just wanted to thank you guys for that. So anyway, I'll talk to you later. Bye.